This video falls under the category of what the hell is this used for and why the heck did I buy it? This is the K-Bar 1331 hatchet. For some reason I got it in my mind that I wanted to try a knife or some sort of a blade with a stacked leather handle. And so I was looking around and I came across these K-Bar uh, sort of vintage I'd say uh, 1980s hatchets and knives and for whatever reason I just thought what the heck let me give one of these a try and um, you know I, I thought it was going to be neat and then it showed up and I'm kind of like what the heck did I get this thing for well I'll tell you why I bought it I bought it because it's kind of a classic style you know this type of handle style and overall hatchet design it's been around since the early 1900s and so I kind of thought you know I'm into all these sort of modern knives and why not try something with a little more of a classic feel get my hands on it see if it was something that I'd enjoy using or might even have some good use for me but when I got it I think I learned pretty quickly that I don't really have any true use for this it's just kind of a, a novelty I mean with all the you know, nice tools that I have to use. Would I really reach into my collection and pull this out for a, you know, for a day hike or for some sort of camp tasks? I don't know. Probably not. But at the same time, it's just kind of cool. I mean, in a lot of ways, this thing's very impractical. I mean, take a look at this head. You know, it's not very large. It's extremely thin. In fact, when you look at it against my hand, start to realize how small it really is. I mean, this, this axe head is tiny. This is a small little hatchet. So, what can I really use this for? I mean, I'd have to get creative. I'm certainly not going to be pounding in any, uh, you know, tent stakes or anything like that with a profile that thin you know maybe I could use it to sort of delimb uh, part of a tree where I'm trying to hang up my uh, my hammock or something like that or I don't know I might have to get creative if I really think I'm gonna use this thing I mean the grip feels nice definitely has a, a good feeling grip nice and solid uh, leather handles I like that um, this is almost like a, a pommel uh, maybe I could use that to pound in some steaks or something. I'm not really too sure. It has a strange little sheath. I mean, very light duty in a way. Uh, the one that I got is in a little bit of rough shape. I mean, you know, this could be cleaned up. I could treat it. I could probably get it back into some reasonable shape. It needs a little bit of stitching. Not a big deal. But it um, has this funny embossed image of uh oh, it looks like maybe mountains in a in a lake or something like that some trees but uh yeah, it's a weird little sheath so in practice if i was actually going to take this thing out uh would i use that flimsy little sheath i'm not sure maybe i'd try to make myself a kydex for it now wouldn't that be ironic having the you know classic style of the stacked leather with this uh i don't know what it is i think it's uh 3CR13 MOV or something like that. But, um, you know, the, the classic stacked leather stainless blade with, you know, a Kydex sheath. Be kind of odd, but I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do with this. Um, you know, it's just one of those things I thought would be kind of cool. It's just a little bit of a novelty, I guess. I don't even know whether or not I'll truly keep this because if I'm not going to use gear, I'm just going to move it along. I mean, I, you know, I've talked about it before. I'm more of a user than a collector. So, you know, I just like to try different things and see different things and see what works for me. I like to try to, you know, feel how different handles feel and how different tools will, uh, you know, suit me for different reasons or different situations. And, you know, I saw this one. It was in good shape. I got it for dirt cheap and thought it would be something cool. But, um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what this is really good for, to be honest with you. Um, uh, you know, maybe I'll just play around with it for a little while and then 
figure out whether or not it's worth keeping it. But um, yeah, I just wanted to share this little uh, hatchet with you. So again, this is the K Bar 1331, USA made, stainless steel, stacked leather handle, funny little pommel, and a crappy little sheath. That's all I got for you.